my channel. And being in LA, and I got to meet Anthony Padilla from Smosh, famously, and obviously from his uh, talking to interview stuff recently. I got to meet Game Theory, Matt Pat. Basically, broskies. I was filled with a bit of ambition. I was filled with some some big ol' ambition, and I realized, chat, I have 6.1 million subscribers on YouTube, and I am just not doing anything with it. If I went back to me, like, like when I was like 14, 13, 14, and I said, hey, Wilbur, by the way, uh, you're going to be doing videos with the guy from Smosh, with Game Grumps, with fucking Game Theory. Uh, you, you have like over 6 million subs. I'd be like, oh my God, what kind of videos do I make? I'd be like, oh yeah, you haven't uploaded in like nine months. I'm spoiled, chat. I'm spoiled. I need to humble myself. I need to humble myself. And I'm filled with ambition. I'm filled with drive. And I want to make things. And I want down the line, even if... I don't care how many fucking views it gets. I just want people down the line to be able to say, yeah, I was watching Wilbur Sir. I was That was who I was watching when I was growing up, you know? And I'm sure a lot of you will already say that. But that's my goal. Pull a techno. Techno has the right to have a break, guys. Come on. You can't you can't reference the guy who got cancer as fucking. <laughs> that's it. I think he's allowed to take a little slow down, alright? I was supposed to meet him <clears throat> in California when I came when I went to California when I went to America. I was supposed to meet up with him. Uh but um his doctors basically were like I basically, because I, I didn't want to show up, I didn't want to put him in danger. So uh, I, I asked, like, if he could ask his doctors, you know, for, like, what's going on and, like, his parents and stuff. And he was like, and basically the doctors were like, nah, you can't. So I didn't get to go and see Technoblade, which was a real bummer. I was really sad. I was, I was so excited for the drive. But, yeah, so there we go. So I couldn't see Technoblade. I never got to visit my boy. But yeah, I still I got to see loads of people though, and I will be seeing Technoblade. I refuse, <laughs> I refuse to let him get away. I, I've met all the sleepy boys. We, we're all the sleepy boys. We've all hung out. Some of us in threes, but we've never hung out with Technoblade. And I feel like it's time. And he's promised me he'll come to a, he'll come to England when he's kicked cancer's ass. He's gonna come to England. He's gonna hang out with us, and we're gonna go and get Nando's. And we're gonna play video games, and we're gonna—he's gonna be there for a—he's gonna be there for a Lovejoy gig. <laughs> I'm taking him with me. I'm taking him with me. He's been—he was one of the only people we had a group back at the start of the pandemic. It was like me, him. It was like Nikki, Tommy, Phil, basically all the like, basically back before like this all happened. <laughs> You know, back before, back back when we were, we were all streamers, but none of us were at any level that, you know, like, especially like the level that Tommy and stuff got to. It wasn't, it, we weren't, none of us had even started the, the, the grind yet. And it was like, and that was who we hung out with. So I feel like it's so sad that I haven't got to meet him yet. And I, I want to. <laughs> and I'm gonna. What, he just needs to kick cancer's ass. So that's why he needs to take his break. Let him take as long as he wants with his with his YouTube videos. You know. Last thing he did, last stream he did, he raised fucking tons of money for charity. You know. Fucking let the pig do his shig. Shig? <laughs> I tried to make it rhyme. <laughs>